गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन वेलकम बैक टू सोशल स्टडीज ट्यूटोरियल सो स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स कंटिन्यू आर रिविजन सेशन ऑफ चैप्टर टू डायवर्सिटी प्रिजुडाइज एंड डिस्क्रिमिनेशन सो स्टूडेंट्स इन आर लास्ट सेशन वी हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट प्रिजुडाइज एंड डिस्क्रिमिनेशन वेयर वी हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट दी डायवर्सिटी एंड प्रिजुडाइज so uh, what exactly just after prejudice there is a kind of cre uh, like creation of stereotypes so what exactly the stereotype is a stereotype is uh, a concept or uh, like it is a generalization or an assumption it is a generalization or an assumption which people make for a people or a group of people so that is stereotypes questions we develop stereotypes when we are unable or unwilling to obtain all of the information we would need to make fair judgments about people or situations so television books comic strips and movies or all are abundant sources of stereotype characters because uh, somehow we get the information through these sources then accordingly we create the stereotypes so stereotypes also evolve out of fear of persons from minority groups so let's talk about that why do stereotypes occur stereotypes arise as a way of explaining or justifying differences between groups there is lack of exposure to other groups cultures etc that uh, create stereotypes so if we talk about stereotypes are of uh, different types there could be gender stereotypes which is a belief about the personal attribute of female and males so if we talk about female stereotypes then if baby was girl their tendency are more to girlish thing like wear pink clothes toys like a barbie doll etc whereas in men stereotype from the beginning since they were small boys are taught to be tough to be protective and to defend themselves that is gender stereotypes so just to uh, sum up what we can say that stereotype is the reflection on how people see members of different groups actually behaving stereotypes change should occur when the relation between the group is changing and altered so stereotypes offer a shortcut for meaning as they convey a lot of information quickly and they contains complex information into character who is easy to recognize and easy to deal with so they are often minority groups so students as like stereotype uh, types occurs in minority groups so what exactly there is uh, an existence of discrimination now let's understand the concept of discrimination discrimination is acting toward or treating individuals or groups in a different manner because they are different to the others so uh, discrimination can be of different types like the uh, economic inequality or the uh, gender inequality or so on so if we talk about economic inequality it is the state of affairs in which assets wealth or income is distributed unequally among individuals in india so india being a part of the four nation housing the next number of highest numbers of billionaires a shocking 836 million people in india live below the poverty line bpl and living on less than 50% per day so if we talk about income inequality that is basically the gap between rich and poor as it is the differences in the distribution of economic assets and income within or between populations or individual so it is the state of an economy in which the share of total income earned by the rich and poor are largely unequal while talking about income inequality a question comes to our mind that why there is uh, why there are the what exactly the causes of income inequality so there are the different uh, causes of income in inequality like the trade liberalization changes in taxation and racial discrimination so just to conclude we can say that inequality is still very much a fact of life in india 
and result of deep rooted social and economic structures that perpetuate privilege and limit opportunities for the poor so students this was the concept of stereotypes and income inequality we'll talk about gender inequality and the uh, measures which have been taken by the indian government in our next session till the time stay home stay safe thank you